that's from the Fantasia Super uh, Schmecke dich, O Liebe Seele, from Johann Sebastian Bach. And as we move into our hymn of the week, 462 from ELW, now we join in celebration, I wanted to remind us that some of these tunes are regularly or were regularly set by some of the famous composers and organists of the past. This one, of course, by Johann Sebastian Bach. Uh, and of course, we also have a great setting by Johannes Brahms. But, so I want to give you a little taste of that. Hopefully you heard some of the melody of Now We Join in Celebration, this tune by uh, Johann Krüger, which was known to Bach. I believe it came in a hymnal around 1649, Geistliche Kirchen Melodien, or we could say religious, sacred uh, church melodies. So it's part of that hymnal and uh, Bach certainly liked this and said it in many different uh, chorale preludes. That was just one of them. So what's interesting about this tune is we, it's set in a bar form. So this phrase repeats again, so we have an A, A. And then in the B section, it seems that we have a little uh, setting or little point of the notes being set in threes. So you have that two plus one there, and then in right after there, same thing. So you have a feeling possibly pointing to the Trinity, which was often done even at the time of Bach, set, uh, Bach would set things in threes. So there's a possibility there, we don't know that for sure, but what we can do when we're singing it is we can certainly add that uh, to enhance our worship as we're uh, singing this to God. So that's a little about the melody by Johann Krüger. Let's now look at the text by Joel W. Landin, who was born in China, and his parents were missionaries. And he later became a pastor and a musician, and he moved to the United States. And he was an archivist and librarian in many different places in the United States, but also for the Lutheran Church of America, I believe in the late 1960s. So this text that he constructed was part of a hymnal called Contemporary Worship 4, Hymns for Baptism and Communion, which I believe was around 1972. Uh, so it was a new text then, and then it was included in the Lutheran Book of Worship, or the Green Hymnal, as we like to call it, in 1978 approximately. I think that was the year for it. And uh, when it was included in the hymnal, verses 2 and 3 were edited or modified a bit, and that's what we see today. Now, going back to the music from Kruger, it was originally titled Schmücke dich, O liebe Seele, or Adorn Yourself, O Dear, O Lovely Soul. If we look at ELW, you can see if we go to 488, Soul Adorn Yourself with Gladness, that text by Johann Frank, that was the text that was originally, as far as we know, set with this tune by Johann Krüger. So as I register it for us to sing, I'm excited to debut some of the flutes on Hymn of the Week. We haven't really had much time to do a hymn with just flutes uh, because generally it's not a great, it's not strong enough um, to support a congregation. So we have, I'll be starting with eight and then for the first verse I'll add the four foot flute. So we get to hear the nice flute chorus here. And then for the second verse, I'll add a corne solo really beautiful, almost sort of like we had with the Bach prelude we just heard, the excerpt at the beginning. And then for the third verse, I'll add some sounds, uh, primarily some principles to start, and then I'll alternate between the manuals. Uh, but generally, we're going to stay with a much softer registration. Now we join in celebration. Here we go.
Sometimes I decorate this tune uh, just because of the text it's, itself, the actual words by Frank, the schmücke dich, o oh liebe Seele, decorate. Schmücke also means decorate, not just adorn. And there's a certain decoration we have. Uh, as Christians, there's a meaning and purpose to go on, and life can be exciting with Christ. I think as Christians we'd all agree it rarely gets boring um, when you're with Christ. It certainly can be challenging. It might not always be peaceful. God has definitely promised his presence to be with us at all times. But there is a certain type of decoration. And uh, so I really like that word schmücke. And sometimes I spend a little more time decorating with the ornamentation. But for this week, I think I want to keep it uh, with the flutes and the principles. It just fills the room very nicely, and I look forward to playing it uh, with the congregation singing on Sunday. Thank you for listening.